And across the valley, Earth Day celebrations down in Yakima saw the return of the annual kids fishing and other festivities held at the Yakima Greenway. Reporter Adrian Delgado tells us more about this fun, family-friendly event. Well, a beautiful and sunny day it was to celebrate Mother Earth and Earth Day. Across the state and nation, many gather to demonstrate support for environmental protection, which is what Earth Day is all about. And in Yakima, it was the annual Kids Fishing and Earth Day celebration held at Sarg Hubbard Park in the Yakima Greenway. This free event aims to raise community awareness about environmental issues. We do a lot of educational stuff for kids, for youth, and we do events to get them outdoors and to learn how to fly fish. And we even teach a little woolly bugger fly tying class. So it's it brings joy to our hearts to be able to to pay that forward. Earth Day is an annual celebration that honors the achievements of the environmental movement and raises awareness of the need to protect Earth's natural resources for future generations. Earth Day was founded in 1970 as a day of education about environmental issues. The first Earth Day was organized by Senator Nelson and graduate student Dennis Hayes, brought together 20 million people across the United States. It strengthened support for legislation such as the Clean Air Act and and the Endangered Species Act. Lyle uh, lives in Natchez Heights. He's one and a half years old and he has five brothers and sisters. Um, and they uh, live on my farm. We use their poop in the gardens because it's very good for the plants. And we share them once a year. And his share date this year is June 1st. So they'll take off his blanket. At the Kids Fish Inn and Earth Day Yakima, families and guests were able to interact with featured exhibits, art, and activities designed to educate and engage visitors about how individuals, families, and businesses can contribute to protecting the earth. Plus, registration was open for a Kids Fish Inn, where kids from ages 5 to 14 got a 45-minute fishing lesson, along with the fishing pole they got to keep. Oh, it's, this is one of our favorite events. Um, we have two favorite, and this is top top and it's just being out with the kids and getting kids involved in the outdoors and what better way than fishing just like I started when I was four years old with my dad getting me a pole. In Yakima, Adrian Delgado, Action News.